So in this lecture, we will talk about tuples. Sometimes you will want to create a list of items that cannot be changed. Tuples allow you to do just that. Python refers to values that cannot change as immutable, and an immutable list is called a tuple. A tuple looks just like a list, except you use parentheses instead of square brackets when you create it. Once you define a tuple, you can access individual elements by using each item's index, just as you would for a list. For example, if we have a rectangle that should always be a certain size, we can ensure that its size doesn't change by putting the dimensions into a tuple. We define the tuple dimensions using parentheses instead of square brackets, then print each element in the tuple individually, using the same syntax we have been using to access elements in a list. So dimension equals parentheses 250. Then we create a tuple called dimensions with two elements. Then we can print dimensions first element using index 0 and print the dimension second element using index first using index 1. Let's see what happens if we try to change one of the items in the tuple. So we create the dimensions is 250 two elements tuple then we change the first item of the dimensions to 250 and the Python will print a type error which means tuple object does not support item assignment we can loop through all values in a tuple just as you did with a list so dimensions is a two items tuple and we can use a for loop for dimension in dimensions print dimension this form is exactly the same as you do for a list writing over a tuple although you cannot modify a tuple but you can assign a new tuple to a variable that holds a tuple. So if we wanted to change our dimensions, we could redefine the entire tuple. So the main we can write again with the different values assigned to dimensions. Then we can print modify the dimensions with a loop for loop for dimension in dimensions print dimension. We will show all these commands in an account of spider. So we go to lecture 7 tuples. First, we create a tuple with 250 elements inside run. Then we print the first and the second item of the tuple and 250 displayed. Then we can we try to change the item in the tuple. First, we create this tuple. Then we change, try to change the first item to 250. We run this. In Python, we should error file. This file is line, first line. Because we only run this line. It has a problem. And type error tuple object does not support item assignment. We can loop over all items, all values in a tuple. Then we print original dimensions with a colon, then with a for loop for dimension in dimensions, print each value. You can run this block code. The original dimensions is 250. So here we try to write over a tuple entirely. We create again this tuple. Then we print the modified dimensions this and with a for loop for each 
value in a new tuple. That's right. The tuple is a new and the value is different from the original one. So we can we can create a new tuple if you want to change the value. But we cannot change the values from the original tuple because tuple is immutable.